Oh hi! Thanks for watching my video and welcome back to another ranch episode. So Alyssa is pretty pregnant, she's in her second trimester. She does have pretty much a full day before she goes into her third trimester though, so I reckon we could probably get through this episode without having a baby. And I say that because we've got some pretty big plans for today's episode. Today we're gonna, we're gonna try and get into the Christmas spirit. We're going to have a lot going on today, so I do want to try and avoid having the baby today. Oh no, Tulip's in a bad mood. Oh, I'm sure she'll get over it. We'll just send her for a bit of training, a little bit of jumping, and maybe Pumpkin as well. She can wake up and get off her ass. do a little bit of jumping too. So today in The Sims 4, it is Christmas Eve. Christmas is only a day away. It's already the afternoon, so we've got quite a lot of stuff we need to do today. First things first... We're going to take Dev and we're going to wander down to the Christmas market because one of the traditions for tomorrow is to open presents and currently neither of them have bought anything for each other. So we're going to wander over here to the Christmas market. Here it is. Here's the market. Isn't it beautiful? I got it off the gallery. I'll see if I can find it. This is the one I'm using. It looks like it's been re-uploaded a few times. But you can find it pretty easily on the gallery if you do want to add it for yourselves doesn't seem so Christmassy without all of the snow, but that's fine. We're only doing a drop-by visit. We've just come here to see if we can get some presents. Just find something nice for Alyssa to buy Dev and then something nice for Dev to buy Alyssa. So what we got? What we got? We've got a few clothes. Dev's got enough clothes. This could be interesting. This little trinket table. Maybe a new lamp. Maybe I could give him a trophy because he's never actually earned anything before in his life. I could give him a trophy earned by someone else. Make him feel like he's actually achieved something other than scoring such a hot chick. Oh, this is quite cool. The vinyl record player. I could buy that for him. I reckon he'd really like that as a present. Although I think that's going to go into my build mode. I don't know if I'll be able to actually gift that to him, will I? Oh, yes, it's in my inventory. I can gift it to him. Perfect. Okay, well, that's dev done. Dev, I can see some lovely stuff here. Maybe a new handbag. 650 simoleons. I think that's probably enough. I think that gets the message across how much we love Alyssa. Maybe some perfume as well. This is a real cute little market. They've got loads of stuff around here. Maybe this little vase with the pretty daisies in them. And I don't think that we're actually going to have this baby today, but I think it, it might be a good idea to look at some of the baby stuff so that we're prepared for when the baby comes. What are babies like? Teddy bears? What are you doing, Alyssa? Are you sneaking a present? She's like opening, uh, helping herself to the presents. Oh, they've got another toy stand over here. They even have like a full Christmas shop. Let's go here. Let's have a look at the actual shop. This is pretty cool, this tree. Should we buy that? Nice little decoration for the house. We'll buy this little storybook. There we go. Marissa's spirit is fading away. I didn't even know she was dead. Oh, well, never mind. Well, that was fun. I think I'm a little bit... Christmas shopped out though. I've had a look at all these stalls. I think we've got the best of the best and we also have a Christmas tree at home that we've got to decorate before tomorrow, the big day. So we should probably head off now. Can we decorate this tree together? Decorate with um, ornaments. I think we've got to go red and gold and we'll do that with Dev. That would be pretty cute. We get together, we'll decorate the Christmas tree. Why do they make pregnant sims walk like that? Morning pumpkin, or afternoon, sorry, evening even, evening pumpkin. Oh, Dev's already made a start. Help him out, Alyssa. Don't keep playing the pregnant card. Um, we'll also put on some, I think we need to listen to some Christmas music just to really get into the spirit. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, yeah, decorate it. Um, what else do we want to do? Turn the light on. Let's do a little tree blanket. Can you guys stop gassing and actually... Oh, wow, look at that. Isn't it beautiful? Can we add more decorations, though? Can I add even more if I put a garland... If I put um, red and gold ribbon, will that get rid of the ornaments? Will it override it? Because I quite like the ornaments like that. Oh, they've just become good friends again. Oh, that's so good because their relationship was starting to take a bit of a toll in the last episode. Oh, that makes me happy. Even Patchy's getting into the winter spirit mood. Dancing along to the music, festive music. Looking great, Patch, looking great. I think she's got a mood buff from cheery decoration. A well-decorated tree spreads holiday cheer. Oh, beautiful. 
place present pile under the tree. Oh, blowing kisses at each other. Seriously though, guys, could you hurry up and decorate the tree? It's getting on for nine o'clock. You guys are taking hours. Making a real mountain out of a molehill here. Hurry the fuck up. So we're gonna celebrate Christmas tomorrow, but that's not it. Because this couple, you know, they're a pretty unconventional couple. They're not gonna have a massive wedding party. They are engaged. So I thought it would be nice to have a little Christmas day wedding on our decking here. I already have a few like wedding decorations. So we need to change it up a bit and make it look wedding appropriate. Oh, look at that. Isn't it beautiful? Are you guys gonna go have a little kiss? Well, I know it's only half past nine, which is a bit early for bed, but um, it is Christmas tomorrow. It's gonna be a long day. So I think maybe we should try and get an early night. We might even have a bit of time for a cheeky woohoo. So maybe we'll just go woohoo with Dev and then get a good night's sleep ready for tomorrow. How did Tulip get on with her training? Let's have a look. Oh, she made a little bit, little bit of uh, progress with her jumping skill. How about you, pumpkin? Yeah, yeah, pretty good, pretty good. Merry Christmas Eve, guys. Sleep tight. <laughs> See you in the morning. Well, it's Christmas morning. We're up early so that we can go and clean out the coop, make sure everybody's happy. Dev's going around cleaning all the little mini animals. My horses are all good. I think the dog's fine. He got a very big breakfast this morning. So I think everyone's in a pretty good condition today. We're all in good spirits. I'm not gonna bother doing any harvesting or any like ranch stuff other than taking care of the animals. We're gonna take a day off from the ranch today and the horses are getting a day off from doing any training as well because it is Christmas for them too. Let's light the tree with Dev. Place some presents under the tree as well. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Dev, get over here, we're lighting the tree. Come on, cooperate. I do think the lights are already on. Oh, there we go. No, I can see the difference now. And then also we will see if we can do something cheery, something Christmassy. Share Christmas spirit, there we go. So before we start working on our pile of presents, I think we should give Dev his Christmas gift. Give Xmas gift. And we will do, what was it we bought for him again? I can't even remember now. It was something special. Oh, there we go, record player. Okay, let's give Dev his present. I can't wait to see the look on his face. If he's ungrateful though, I'll be furious. Merry Christmas, Dev. Enjoy, enjoy. What does he think? Is he happy? Is he pleased with his present? Yeah, he is. Oh, good. Okay, well then, Dev, I think probably it's only fair that you give Alyssa her present as well. Give Xmas gift. We got a few different things for Alyssa. None of it in your inventory, except for this daisy bouquet, so... Let's give her the wedding bouquet. I didn't actually realise it was a wedding bouquet. I thought it was just a vase with flowers in it. But that's pretty handy. Seen as we're getting hitched later on today, having a Christmas-themed wedding. And she's happy too. Oh, you guys. Should we do uh, a kiss under the mistletoe? Little mistletoe kiss? They both seem so happy. I think Alyssa's waddling over, trying to find somewhere to do the, the mistletoe kiss. I wonder if there are any Christmas films that came with the movie Hangout stuff. I'll have a little look in a minute. I've never noticed any Christmas movies. They're missing a trick if they haven't. Is there anything Christmassy? Roaring Vi Simda? No, I don't think there are any Christmas movies. No simlish version of Home Alone. That's a shame. Well, seen as we know a grand meal takes hours, and seen as we know the last time we tried this, we set the place on fire, I think we should make a start on the grand meal now. Let's do ham this time. Yeah, we'll make a start. I don't see why we started a fire last time because our cooking skill is like level nine. So there should be no reason why we'll start a fire, but, oh, Dev, come clean up this puddle, please. But we'll start cooking now anyway, just to allow ourselves enough time for if it gets fucked up or if the place catches fire or something, we at least give ourselves enough time to make a second grand meal. Father Christmas, I think, is going to end up being a, a wedding guest of ours. Lucky him. We are also going to invite over a few more friends. I'm not going to do an event, but I am just going to call over our close friends, the people that we invited to be in the wedding party. So Sienna's going to come over, Cindy. I can't actually remember who else we asked. I think Lyle. Lyle Chesler might have come. I do already have a wedding dress for Alyssa. Dev, though, I can't remember if I actually gave him like a tux or a wedding outfit or anything. Let's see. Oh, well, we've got that, that pink suit and a gray suit. So we could maybe, I think we'll go pink suit for tonight. Very nice, very nice. You're gonna look dashing, Dev. Okay, now remember this time, 
We're not gonna start a fire, okay, Alyssa? Not on Christmas. Oh, like a pro, look at her, look at her, go for it. Oh, in fact, seeing as it is Christmas day, I should probably make a start and use some of my inventory stuff. I should probably make a start and try and get this place ready for our wedding. So the benches, I'm just gonna move out of the way, stick some of them there and then put the other two in my inventory. We probably do wanna keep the dance floor, so maybe I'll, I'll move it to the edge and see if I can fit all of our wedding stuff to one side. It's not gonna be like all bells and whistles. I just got like a few things. So we've got our little wedding arch there. It's gonna be quite an intimate affair. So we've, I've only got a few chairs, just four chairs, and even that might be too many. Something like that, oh yeah. And then just for decor, we'll stick a few of these like flower arrangements either side. There we go, nice candles over here. We'll have a wedding sign, even though it's gonna be so small that no one could possibly get lost. I just like the way they look. We'll put a sign there. And then we're gonna use one of these as well to feed everyone. We'll just have it there, right next to the dance floor. I hope I can fill that thing with cheese. Okay, we're wedding ready, but we'll wait until it gets dark because I think it'll be pretty when it gets dark. And we also have some sparklers in our inventory, so we're gonna celebrate with some pretty sparklers after we get hitched. Still cooking that thing, huh? Okay, I think we've been cooking for almost an hour. It's gotta be ready soon, surely. Oh, perfect, okay, why have you got thumbs down, Dev? Fuck off, be a bit more grateful, son. Right, I'm gonna move this to the center of the table. And I think what I might do is, I'm gonna invite over Sienna, Cindy, and Lyle. We have made a grand meal, and really that's far too much food just for the two of us, so I think we'll invite over some friends and we'll at least feed them. And then we'll just, we're just gonna go to town on that pile of presents, we're just gonna go fucking mental. Okay, Sienna Grove's on the bus, great, good to know. What about Cindy, is she strolling over? Is she galloping over on her horse? Hey Jeff, Merry Christmas. And Lyle will be right over, okay, perfect. So if I say, call to grand meal, there we go. Who the fuck are you? Oh, it's the maid. Oh, well, I suppose the maid can have a Christmas dinner, seeing as he came in to do the cleaning. You didn't have to come to work today, it's a public holiday, but you go for it. You go for it. Everyone grab a plate, please. Help yourselves, help yourself. Is the maid clearing that up? What the fuck, man? You single-handedly ruined Christmas. Let's get this back out, back on the table, and Dev, you can call everyone to grand meal. Tell the maid to fuck off trying to ruin Christmas. This is because I made him work on Christmas Day. That's what this is all about. Grab a plate, everybody. Please, help yourselves, please. Be seated. Oh, this is nice. Everyone coming together for Christmas dinner. No one sitting down, just grabbing plates, wandering around my house, snooping about. Yes, yeah, what Christmas is all about, isn't it? Feeding a load of freeloaders. What's wrong, Alyssa? You need to go take a shit? You go for it, girl. It's Christmas. You treat yourself. Other than that, though, her needs are pretty good. So once you get done on the throne, uh, I think what we need to do... We gotta open some presents, man. Okay, so far this is a very successful Christmas. Dev and Alyssa have both ticked off everything except Father Winter. Don't tell the dog to get out. If the dog wants to watch you shit, he can watch you shit. Sorry about that, Jeff. Oh, bills have been delivered on Christmas? Really? Okay, let's go and open presents. We may as well do it as a group. I mean, we didn't pay for all these, so let's just get everyone together. And then if someone actually gets something good, then we can mug them and take the good present. All right, gather round, guys, gather round. Do we still have... Someone keeps turning off the Christmas music and putting, like, electronica on, and it's p pissing me right off. It's Christmas Day. Dev, if that's you, I bet it's patchy. Okay, I don't think they could get to it. Where, why aren't you guys opening presents? Okay, finally, finally, we're starting to open some presents now. Oh no, Alyssa seems really disappointed by what she got. One carrot as a gift. Alyssa isn't particularly happy about this. Oh, and she got a sad mood buff. Underwhelming gift. Oh dear, I wonder Dev might get something good though. He seems really happy. A Schnapple coffee? Like a coffee machine or just a cup of coffee? I don't think we actually really got anything there, but you know, typical Dev, he's still smiling, he's still like, woohoo, cheering. He's just happy with whatever he gets. Alyssa's kind of a bit more used to the nicer stuff, which surprises me, considering she comes from very humble beginnings, Alyssa. Remember when we first moved in here? It was just an empty field? Appreciate your carrot. Should we maybe make a toast? 
A little Christmas toast. These guys are kind of doing things a little bit quicker than what I thought. I thought we would still have, um, oh, I'll delete those presents if you can't get there. I always find when I play through Winterfest that it just takes so long to get my Sims to do anything that usually by this, by the time I've done like three activities, it's already like time for bed. So because I've managed my time a bit better, I now have lots of free time. So I guess we'll make a toast. Patchy's joining us. Merry Christmas, Patch. We'll enjoy our champagne while we're pregnant. And then I think even though there aren't any Christmas films, it's still going to be a while before it starts getting dark. So I think we should just watch a movie together. I think probably Diamonds Are For Sims might be the most Christmassy. It's probably as Christmassy as we're going to get. I don't know who this straggler is, actually. You weren't invited, so you can fuck off. Let's all get together and watch a nice non-Christmas film on Christmas Day. Patch, you're welcome too. I didn't have the option to watch the movie with him, but he can join if he wants. Kind of wish there was snow outside, because we could have built some, like, snow pals or something. Oh, it's good to see someone's having a good Christmas, eh, Patch? Well, seeing as we still have a bit of time, um, should we maybe... Let's see if we can rustle up, like, a nice festive dessert for everybody. Like a trifle or something. Chocolate pie, there we go. We'll go, we'll go chocolate pie. Serve up some dessert. So the whole point of today is to make you all eat so much that you feel uncomfortable, that you can't move or breathe. That's what Christmas is all about. I still find it so, well, I found it really surprising living in the US that Christmas dinner isn't like much of a thing. I think some people do it, but it's not generally considered like a thing that everybody does. But then I suppose you guys have Thanksgiving and that's kind of when you have your big meal. Ours is Christmas, we like a big Christmas dinner. You need a shit again. All right, we'll finish making the chocolate pie and then you can you can go. Okay, put the pie down and call to meal. Pop it down. Let everyone know they can come get some pie and then go and use the bathroom. Oh, the dog's eaten his Christmas breakfast. Dev, I think maybe we'll give him seconds. Okay, so I wonder, because I'm not actually hosting a wedding event, I wonder if I can have guests be seated. I can, um, no, I don't think so. All right, well, what if I just instead create a group? If I get our guests as part of a group and then I can ask them to just sit together and then Dev, you can get over here. It's gonna start getting dark soon, so I don't mind doing the ceremony now. We'll have a nice sunset ceremony. Right, okay, Dev, let's get you dressed in your finery. We'll put you in your, your pink suit. And Alyssa, I'm going to stick you in your wedding dress and I'm going to get you to hold your flowers as well. Oh, beautiful, stunning bride. Okay, hold your bouquet. I always get confused between walk up or walk down, so I'm going to say walk down the aisle. Dev, you just stay there, man. You just stay there. Is she going to... Oh, there she goes, walking down the aisle. Not many people are watching, but hopefully people will start staring eventually. Get married to Alyssa Coleman. Oh, already kissing. Guys, you're sort of jumping the gun a little bit. At least my guests are outside. At least they followed somewhat basic instructions. Oh, my outside lights are starting to come on. Oh, this is beautiful. It's so pretty as well. I love a Christmas-themed wedding. I didn't have a Christmas-themed wedding myself, but I always thought, you know, if I ever do get married again, Christmas wedding, I think, will be the way we go. Are people actually... Okay, all my guests are watching. They're not sitting, but they are watching at least. So that's something. And also, it's going to be 8 o'clock soon, so Father Winter will be turning up any minute now. Maybe he'll come and congratulate us. Oh, beautiful ring. Oh, you guys. I know you're cold, but, you know, beauty is pain. Okay, can I fill this thing up with cheese? Fill fountain with... Cheese, yes! Get the cheese going, girl. And then maybe we'll just have a, a cheese dipper. Improve cheese. You enjoy your cheese dipper. You've earned it, Alyssa. What a beautiful day. What a beautiful Christmas day. Oh no, she's freezing cold. Ah, oh, fine. Put your winter out it. Put your winter outfit on for a minute until you run out of being freezing. Okay, back to normal. I do want to put you back in your dress for when we play with the sparklers, though. Oh, now you sit. Okay. Where's Father Winter? I don't see him anywhere. Did he forget about me this Christmas? Okay, now that it's actually dark, I might, um, might start playing with some of these sparklers. Okay, let's light up our sparklers. Where's yours, Alyssa? Alyssa seems to have a phantom sparkler. I don't know if that's just because she's, like, pregnant or why she's not allowed a proper sparkler. <laughs> oh, there we go. She finally has one. Oh, you have a good time, girl, on your wedding day. What a beautiful day had by all. 
And on that note, I think I'm going to end this Christmas episode here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>